We're bringing up Mr. Jasmine. Woo, Jasmine. Yeah, how you guys doing? <laughs> yo, what's up, nurses? Yeah, yo, nurses is my type. But not you. You get it. You get it. You get it. You guys are about to be nurses, right? Where are you guys? But you're not my type. Yeah, I feel like when you are my type, you guys are all going to be the same group, but the couple splits when she's with her. And yeah, I see the chemistry. See how she's not even paying attention right now. Nope. Oh, everybody. You guys, keep up. Anyways, <laughs> when I was a kid, I was a little jazz motherfucker. That and that little dad. I wore dress pants and a t-shirt. Oh yeah, all the ladies love it. My hero was Dizzy Gillespie. This motherfucker's like, I'm running for president, man. You know, you dig? I'm running for president. This world harmony, you know it's all about that. So I'm running for president, you guys. Yeah. Real dumb baby, you can look me up on Instagram, it's a real thing. I'm your next presidential candidate. You just write it in. No affiliation. I want to be do you wanna be affiliated with anything? Right? Do you wanna be affiliated with anything? See? Yeah. People are smart. They're like, nope, nope. Fuck shit. Fuck that. Uh, I'm gonna do a couple of things. First of all, I know you guys want a clean president. Everyone wants a clean president, right? Yeah. Yeah. You want a clean president. I did I did the right thing, you guys. I went and took an STD test. I passed. So I yeah. No, everything. All That's the good stuff. Part. That's I'm good stuff. To you guys. Like, it's my candidate. Seriously, it's been years. I mean, the latex allergy, you know, the vasectomy, all that stuff working against me. I just had the worst life. I'm bringing back Nas Prima Nocte. You guys saw about Nas Prima Nocte, right? No. Oh, come on, Nas Prima. That was a classic. Braveheart. Yeah, Braveheart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Basically, back in olden times, if the king couldn't have an heir, he would consummate every wedding until he had an heir, right? So that's, you know, that's my thing. No, it's not you guys. Do you think I want to be there at your wedding? Come on, this guy? I mean, you're a nurse, but come on. I'm waiting for Taylor Swift, you guys. Yes! Perfect for our next song, right? It was me and my wedding night. Me and my wedding night. And then the key came in. And then the key came in. Oh, yeah. Spoil the good. Yeah. I just really, Taylor Swift's gotta shut the fuck up. I love Taylor, no, don't get me wrong. She's just so sad. But it's great, I love that about Taylor. What a great person. Um, let me see, what else, what else? We we all sick of politicians fucking you for your money, right? Let's give it up for politicians Ooh. fucking you for your money. Come on, everybody, yeah. We know, yeah, yeah. So, no, this is the thing, this is what we're gonna do, all right? You want to become a politician, you got to spend a year on the strip and dates, all right? Yeah. If you're going to fuck me for money, I should be able to fuck you for money. That's just, right? Yin yang, right? We want to balance. It's all about, you know. No, it's just me. I'm still going to do it. Uh, let me think. What else? What else? What else? <sighs> yeah, it's the politician. Everybody's worried about Google, right? Google knows everything about you, right? Google, like, Knows what you like, what you're shouting. Everyone's phones is shouting. Yeah, oh yeah, now. yeah. When I plug my charger in, my, my headphone thing comes on for some reason. Anyways, we're going to stop all that, all right? But I still want to know where everybody is, okay? Just for safety reasons, all right? We got this new thing. It's called the fecal recognition system. Yeah, yeah. We're going to implement it in every town. We got satellites to go into your septic tank, all right? <laughs> my friend developed this chip. 30,000 fecal samples in one second. 30,000. You can do major cities across the country, people. It's amazing. It's amazing. Oh. You see, what else? What else? Turner, Tina Turner died. Oh. Yeah. I got a thing for ghosts. No, it's good for me. No, nobody? No, yeah. Sometimes I do want to be patient. I love it because I don't really believe people die. So when my friend dies, like, my dad's gone. I'm like, is he? Is he really, bro? That's fucked up. Are you going to say your dad's gone, bro? You love him. Oh, yeah, he just disappeared, you piece of shit. How dare you? Fuck. Anyways, I'm sorry. All right, what do you want to change about America? What? What? No, just one thing. Taxes. Do we need taxes, bro? Do you like streets? Do you like streets? Do you like dogs? You wouldn't have dogs without taxes. Do you like dogs, though? This man's for taxes now. See how he just changed it, right? And what's something you love about America? What do you love about America? 
the Patriots Ooh. in the country. <laughs> Dude, they gotta calm down. Too hostile, too hesitant. Patriot motherfuckers. Chill out. We already good. There's no more. You calm down. You take it from here to here. I'm not the Patriots. Now relax, right? The football team always winning, man. Every fucking. You know, LeBron, you guys aren't into sports. I can tell because nobody got that shit. Thank God. This is my crowd. All right. Hawaii. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm. You all drive nice cars? You got a nice car. Oh. <laughs> yeah, see, she's like, shut the fuck up. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I don't drive a nice car. <laughs> this morning I put a Rolls Royce in there. It's nice. It's nice now. Uh, let me see. What do you want? What do you love about America? All the freedom. All the freedom. No, we can't hate on freedom. Wait, there's a joke there. Oh yeah, so me and your wife are free. Or this is the one that's the wife. We're free to do whatever we want. <laughs> oh, she's into it. That's messed up. All right, you know what? Redacted. All right. What do you, oh, what do you what do you love about America? The Second Amendment. I don't know any of the moment as a presidential candidate. I promise to you that I'm going to learn all the amendments and how to say it properly. What's the Second Amendment, sir? The right to bear arms. Yeah, in the bedroom, right? Who doesn't want to shoot off when you're shooting off? Am I right? I get the cops called on me constantly. We're going to change that one. All right. You, sir, in the back, what do you want to change about America? Huh? Oh, he's chill. See, there's people like this. We need change, bro. We got to grow. We can't just relax on this shit. He's trying to grow. What do you want to change about America? Yeah, or what do you love about America? I'm, I'm chilling too. You're chilling too. See, it's too many chilling people. We are not on our A game, all right? These are like C plus students back here. What would you change, bro? <laughs> I like to play off my crowd. Maybe I'll change my crowd working technique. That's like that's up on my A game. What's the red flag for you in the workplace, sir? Let's see, because you're such a, a just person. What's the red flag flag for you at the at the workplace? Yeah. At the workplace. <laughs> you know, a big red flag for me. Somebody who just talks about sex all the time. Like, can we get over it? You know, my eyes are here. Sir, Sir my eyes are here. Sir. All right. What, what's a red flag for you at the workplace? Yeah, what's a red flag? They stink, right? Are you in sales? No, but they, they have a, uh, what's it called? They have like the essential oils machine Ooh. going. It's like oh. a fire hazard. Oh. <laughs> Do you want a fire hazard at work? Look at this, right? A fire breaks out work, you get a half day. You probably don't work out in the back for a week and get paid. If you need somebody to start a fire, I know a guy. Yeah, you can look at it. After hours, that's fire. Once yeah. we all leave. Burn, baby, burn. It's going for Can you smell that vacation time coming? Yeah. Right? <laughs> Everybody needs a break. You're a workaholic. You gotta relax. I can't wait for that fire for you. I can't wait. It's gonna be amazing. I'm the only one that's messed up with you, I guess, you know, the night. Okay. Everyone else gets it all. Oh, wait, it's steam and oil? No, that's a crazy fire. fire hazards are steam and oil is like, it's steamy. All right, you, Miss on the phone, what are you looking at? Miss, we wanted to ask you because we're worried you're showing all the signs of social anxiety. Are you okay? Because we can take a moment just to address any, any of your wants or needs. Oh, no, I'm all set. I just want to say, ask, I'm, I'm, I'm worried and concerned, but you seem like you're okay, which is also a red flag. It's classic waterboarding, right? Yeah, she's fun. She's fun. No, you're amazing. Thank you. I'm getting there. I stole it all from this other presidential dad. I got in his car. He had a whole list of all this shit. It was great. Who's been to Hawaii? One person. This is rough. You know, I want to keep going, you guys. You do, I really do. Oh, Ecuador? Ooh. Ooh. CC. Did you have a Latina lover? No. Oh. Well, there's always time. Will's here. 
He's pretty much a Latina. He's OG Latina. He gets grumpy. I'm old. I'm not even man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. You look. You got a little Latin flavor, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Wait till he's a nurse. Oh, you already. Oh, my man. All right. Wait. Red flag in the nursing. Red flag in the nursing is uh, lazy. Are you want lazy co-workers because you're going to shine and go to the top and he's going to have a raise and I'll be in president and I'll call you like, bro, I just put a recommendation for you to be head nurse. He got the I can like that. I can All right. I'm going to give that to the host most. Woo! Cool. 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 All right.